Hello YouTube and here we go with the next Google Nexus 5 video. This time we are doing the setup and taking a quick tour around in Android 4.4 KitKat. So we got our SIM card tray opener. SIM card tray is on the right side of the phone. Just push it in and you get your SIM card tray. Take your micro SIM card, put it in this way and then slide it back into the phone and hit the on off button on the right side. Push it, push it, push it, push it. It will vibrate and you will see the Google logo. And now let's find out if there's a new boot animation. Yes, finally with Android 4.4 KitKat we get a new Google Android boot animation and this is... <sighs> so next step. Choose your lingu language, English, then it will start searching for a Wi-Fi. You can skip this step, but I'm at home, I got my Wi-Fi, so I will enter my Wi-Fi password. Typing in the password was really nice. And then next question, got Google, do you have a Google account? Of course we do have one, so sign into your Google account. It's signing in, it's signing in. And next question, backup and restore. Backup your data to Google account. Restore previous backups to this device. Yes, please. Location services, yes, of course. And communications, keep up to date with news and offers from Google Play. No, it's not activated and this is a good one. So next step. And it's starting to restore previous settings. This phone belongs to, put in your name or don't. Google Now, information when you need it. Uh, we already know that Google Now is deeply integrated into Android 4.4 KitKat and the new Nexus 5. So get Google Now, of course. We want the full package. Welcome screen, make yourself your home. At home, create more screens for apps and folders. Search OK Google to start search. Google Now, left swipe, OK. Organize your space and hang out. Oh, this is another one. You won't have a uh, separate SMS texting app anymore. This is integrated into Google Hangout. So next step. And swiping left or right should give you Google Now. Okay. On the right side, three screens, uh, screens you can create more. Um, and then let's find out it's downloading old apps settings and we got about phone model number nexus 5 we got android 4.4 a nice lead trick hit it again and you get the scrolling k uh, rotating then we get android push that and keep pushing keep pushing there was a nice neat trick here yes Swipe down to exit, okay. There's a nice hidden screen with all the previous screens, uh, screenshots and symbols of the previous Android versions. Cupcake, Donut and Eclair and all the stuff. It doesn't do anything, it's just for playing around. So let's go back and find storage. This is a 16 gigabyte version. So we have available around 12 gigabytes are free on the 16 gigabyte model. So keep this in mind, maybe upgrade for 50 bucks to the dub twice the memory. I like the new home screen, the new wallpaper here on Android 4.4, better than the old one in 4.3 from the next seven here. This looks really nice. And what else? I guess this is it. Everything else looks normal to me. And um, pretty much it. This is a new Nexus 5 from Google and LG. And um, not, I'm still not sure if white was the right, uh, right choosing here. The backside looks great, but it got this glossy black surrounding here. Hmm, not pretty sure if I like this, but still, I want the official covers cases here, the red version or the yellow version, and then it won't matter. What matters is on the front, you got this white spot here. This is your speaker, and it will be always white, and I have no idea why they designed this one to be white. So this is it. Thank you guys for watching. I see you in the next video. Oh, I'll give it a try. Okay, Google. Hmm.
doesn't work for me right now. Okay, Google. Hmm. Maybe because I was talking all the time. Hmm. I have to do this. Okay, Google. No, doesn't work for me right now. I will figure this out and I see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching and bye.